26 is good food. Okay. Let's see what it says. The spar is showing. Last time we were here, we had just finished the tail sections uh, for your airplane. Where are we today and why are we here today again? Today we're here working on a, uh, the wings of the aircraft. Uh, thanks to Venus once again, they have allowed us to come in and have a wing workshop. Uh, chapter 429 of EAA from Jefferson City. They all came down and pitched in. Uh, we're going to be here all week. Um, different members are going to come in different days. 
starting tomorrow, which would be Tuesday. We're expecting some 50 uh, Cub Scouts with their parents to come in each day on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday for a total of 150 Cub Scouts are going to come in. And they're going to try to pull rivets on my wing also. Thanks to Chapter 429, and they come in, everybody's come in and pitched in. And uh, tomorrow they'll be back out again. And all week long we have the different members coming. Some of them are coming two, three days. Some of them only coming one day. But even the ones that came in today, they did so much work, knocked out so much. You can look at the uh, accomplishment we did in one day. Uh, the chaperones are done. I mean, so much work was, was actually put out. Uh, we've actually deburred uh, most of the wings for tomorrow already. And uh, so when the towels get here, they should be able to pop rivets and, and go. Pull a rivet and go. Pull a rivet and go. All right. Yeah, that, that, so that should help at that point. Yeah, I was impressed because uh, it seemed at the very beginning it was a bit of a slow start. But uh, after lunch, you guys got really motivated, it seems, because... Uh, I'm impressed. It looks like we've got a major wing assembly done, and like you said, the flaperons are pretty much all done. So it's coming along well. So uh, by Friday, you hope to have both sets done? By Friday, we have planned to have both sets done uh, uh, to a point. If it's not where I can come by and just do touch ups and stuff like that. Um, the same thing happened with the um, tail section. You know, I still fine tuning it and stuff like that, but right now it's looking good. Excellent. Now, do you find that the experience from having built the tail, is that helping you guys building the wings? Each section just helps. It, it builds on the knowledge you gave from the last section. Everything seems to run very smoothly. And um, I've been, you know, going around, like we just had our um, fly-in in California. Two Zeniths flew in, uh, which is good. When you see the planes coming in, then you say, hey, Next year, I, maybe I'll be here too with my plane. Absolutely. Uh, and it's, it's just so good when you see so many of these planes out there flying and just having a good time. And the uh, um, companionship and everybody just coming out, throwing, and, and to get this done. Uh, more chapters should consider doing this. Um, I understand at Oshkosh this year they have build a wing. Yeah, we're going to be building, I believe, five sets of wings, two sets of which will be Zenith wings. So. It'll be interesting a uh, year again at Oshkosh for everyone, I think. Yes, uh, I'm looking forward to that. Uh, and I just hope that all the other chapters start to look at what we're doing here and follow this example. Get out there, work as a team, get the aircraft built, and get to flying. Right, absolutely. Now, I don't think all the chapters will be able to do it here at the Zenith factory, right? I hope not, right? <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, they have to expand the factory. That or, you know, but again, we, as we can see, it's all simple workbenches, so it yeah. doesn't require it here to be at the no, factory. But, but the team, the teamwork, getting the other chapter members involved yep. at your location. Absolutely. And out and getting it done. Yeah, yeah. Well, we look, uh, I look forward to checking in with you later in this week. Uh, we'll see how the progress goes, and uh, I look forward to hearing what you have to say at that point. And I'm looking forward to seeing 150 scouts come through here. <laughs> That'll be interesting, won't it? All right, thanks, Chris.